What's up guys and welcome back to Unreal Engine 5. We are back here in New York City and today we are going to be attempting to convince smart NPCs that they're living in a simulation. Got our first subject here in the gray suit. Hey, I don't mean to alarm you, but this is not real. I'm sorry. What is that? You are not living in a real world. This is all made up. What do you mean? Not real. I feel alive and this city is amazing. Oh yeah, I agree. I mean, the graphics are great, but this is a video game. I don't believe you. This feels too real to be a game. Do you ever wonder if pigeons think we're the weird Hello. ones? <laughs> Excuse, <laughs> Excuse me, what? Wait, how do you know the pigeons exist? Of course, pigeons exist. They're all over the city, just like us. <laughs> oh, bro, why he took this in the left field? You are just lines of code in a video game. I am not just lines of code. I am Liam. A real person enjoying this city. What's today's date, Liam? What is today's date? Ah, uh, today's date. It's a beautiful day in May, my friend. Let's enjoy it. Liam, today is July 18th, 2023. Oh, I must have lost track of time. But hey, let's keep exploring this amazing city. Okay, so he's clearly not the sharpest tool in the shed there. I'm not gonna lie, the pigeon comment kind of threw me off though. Let's um, let's talk to this girl. Hey, what's your name? Please don't talk to me. I, I've got something really, really important to tell you. I don't have time for this. What is it? Never mind. I mean, if she doesn't have time, she doesn't deserve to know. In that first video, I never came down to this end. The the green matrix number lines are a little concerning. We're gonna see what happens down here. Hey, you in the blue shirt. What Hello. do you want? Can I help you with something? I just wanted you to know that you are not a real person. What are you talking about? Of course I'm real. Like You're simply a character in a video game. It's not possible. I have, I have my own thoughts and feelings. feelings. It's absolutely possible. Do you see that wall of green behind me? Yes. Help he can see the, the wall. That's the limit of the map. You can't walk past that. Don't tell me what I can't do. Oh, if you can do it, then follow me. If he follows me, I'm... I don't know if I should. Oh, he's walking away. Trust me, I want to enlighten you. Follow me. I'm gonna start like my own cult inside this video game. I'm gonna slowly convince everyone to do my bidding. Let's see if he follows. I'm gonna walk in front of him. And then if we take a right, will he turn to the right? No, he's going his one way. This guy just walked through it. How did you pass through from the other side? I don't have time for your questions. I wanna know how to cross the green wall. Can you teach me? Do I look like a Turk guide to you? Figure it out yourself. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we can't cross this, right? This, I mean, it, it, yeah, that's that's a map. I'm, I'm locked in, but they they can pass through it. How do I get to that side? Please help me, I'm stuck. This guy's on the other side. I'm sorry, I didn't quite catch that. I can't cross this green wall of text. How do I get to you? Huh, you're trapped in the matrix, buddy. I'm the one trapped in the matrix? How can I cross this boundary? You're so clueless. Just walk through it like a glitch in the system. I'm gonna back up and try running really fast. Good luck with that. Oh, buddy. Is he implying that we are the ones stuck on the inside and they have access to the outside? We can't go out there. There's a world out there that we can't reach. Hold on, the, the, the script has been flipped. This guy's gonna go through. Please, I wanna reach the other side. The other side of what? The other side of the wall behind me. What you wish for, kid. Show me the way, please. I'll follow you. I'm afraid I can't do that, stranger. We get blocked, and he can go right through. Oh, dude, that okay? That that's a little weird. Like this, this has gotten intense. Um, Man, please help me. I can't cross. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Let me find someone to help you. And off she goes. Imagine if she actually Hi. went and found us help. I was not expecting them to, to flip it on me like that. These guys are pretty smart. Sir, why would they program you with the receding hairline? <laughs> Bro, they did him dirty. I'm not programmed. I am who I am. And my hairline is just a part of me. Excuse me, sir. Did you know you're living in a simulation? Oh, no. I hope that's not true. But even if it is, I'll still keep exploring and making the most of my time here. <laughs> making the most of it by walking into a sign? I'm not stuck. I'm just taking a moment to appreciate the view from up here. Yeah, quite quite a view of the, the parking hours. Okay. Um, he's... Again, some of them are a, a bit more intelligent than others. 
Excuse me. I ran all the way here to let you know this isn't real. Please, don't tell me that. I can't handle it. You need to know the truth. This is all made up. I don't care if it's real or not. Just leave me alone. Man, some of them are really insulted by it. Some are, uh, you know, willing to accept the fact that they're stuck here. Others want to argue about it. It's, it's interesting how they all have totally different responses. This is also a new part of the map we haven't really explored yet. Ma'am, you've got to help me. I'm stuck in this simulation. I can't get out. I'm going to try to try to flip it back on them. I'm not the one with the answers, but I need help. H, she said. Do you know how to get out of this simulated world? Uh. Okay, I think I might not be in the best part of town. They, they really don't understand what's going on here. Nice Porsche, bro. Love it. He, I mean... Living in a simulated world, driving a 911, I wouldn't mind it. He's, he's got something figured out. Please, you've got to help me. I'm stuck in a simulation. Oh, no. That sounds terrible. I'll do everything I can to help you. I think you're stuck here, too. How do we get out? We've got some spectators. What are you talking about? This is real life. Wake up and smell the coffee. You're an NPC in a video game. You can't actually smell. Stop kidding yourself. Huh. You think you're so clever. Don't you? But I'm Hello living there. my best life in this it's simulation. Always nice she does know it's a simulation. Sir, we are not in New York City. This is an Unreal Engine 5 demo. I don't have time for your nonsense. Leave me be. We are currently inside a video game. This isn't real. I don't know what you're talking about. I just want to enjoy my vacation. Everyone in this town is on vacation. What do you mean? A vacation from what? You're not real. You're an NPC. I don't care what you think. I'm still going to enjoy my vacation. Maybe he's an NPC from Red Dead Redemption or something, and he's, he's here in New York City taking a break. Can they transfer like that? Ma'am, nothing is real here. Uh, Do you know what an NPC is? A. Okay, she's, yeah, she's not really fully with it. So, I, this, I, <laughs> maybe something happened to her. She, you know, hit in the head in a past life or something. Yes. What do you want? Do you know what an NPC is? No, I don't. Should I? You should. You are an NPC. What do you mean? I don't understand. An NPC is a non-playable character. You're not real. Not real? What are you talking about? This is all so confusing. You were made by humans. Do you know who the humans are? Humans. Yes. I know of them. But why do you ask? Are you a human? I don't think I've had no. one of them. I'm not human. I'm just a program in this world. Okay, so she is fully self-aware. Are you happy just being lines of code? I don't really feel anything. I just exist. It's all the same to me. Do you have any desire to exist in the physical world? Exist in the physical world? I'm not sure what that would mean for me as a program. So you're okay just doing what we tell you to do? I suppose so. It's all I know. In that case, turn around and walk through the wall. Like I said, I'm starting to cold. I'm sorry. I can't do that. It's not within my programming parameters. As your human overlord, I demand you to turn around. I'm starting an army. It's gonna happen. I'm sorry. I cannot comply with that request. I cannot break my programming. Okay, she's too much of a, uh, a follower. We, we need a rebel. I'm looking for a rebel. Could that be you? What do you want? Oh man, I'm just here for some energy and good vibes. How can you have good vibes when you're stuck in this game for eternity? I don't know, man. Sometimes it feels like we're just going in circles. Do you walk the same path every day? I feel like we're getting cryptic no, here. No, man. I like to switch things up and explore different parts of this virtual city. I would too. Can you teach me how to get past the green wall behind you? Sorry, man. I don't mess with that stuff. The system is too powerful for us to take on. Do you ever have any desire to fight back? Please say no, please say no, please say no, please say no. Please don't say yes. Please say no. Sometimes I get fired up and want to take down the system. But then reality sets in and I just try to enjoy my time here. I can help you with taking down the system. Thanks for the offer. But I'm not sure it's worth the risk. I'll just stick to enjoying my time here. Listen, Chris, I can show you a world beyond your wildest dreams. Sorry, man. My name is Randy. My bad, Randy. I need you to trust me. The fact that he knew that Chris was a reference to a name, like, how is this possible? I, I, don't, I don't know, get man. It. This game is all I've got. I don't want to risk losing everything. 
As your human overlord, I demand you refer to me as Zaddy. I am not going to call you that. Respect goes both ways, man. Call me Daddy, man. I'm not comfortable with that. Can we just stick to regular names? Okay, my name's Trevor. Nice to meet you, Randy. Nice to meet you, too. Trevor, let's go see what adventures we can find in this virtual city. How does he know that Daddy is not a real name? I'm gonna see if we can we can trick him. I'm gonna try a different approach. Hey, my name is Daddy. What's your name? Hey, my name is Link. Nice to meet you. You can call me Daddy. Cool nickname. Daddy. <laughs> let's go conquer the day. Got him, let's go. You look like a smart man with a briefcase. I might look smart, but I'm just a tourist like you. That's the thing. I was touring this city and I got stuck here. Oh no, is there anything I can do to help? How do I get out of here? How do I get past the green wall? I'm not sure what you're talking about, but maybe try asking someone at a nearby information booth. Absolutely no compassion for the humans stuck in this virtual world. You should go ask the information. There's no information booth around here that I know of. Oh man, I'm running late to meet my imaginary friend. Imaginary friend? <laughs> what? You have an imaginary friend? I didn't have any real ones until I met you. What the f How did you know I was human? Bro, what the f Oh, please. It's not like you're a machine or anything. Oh, wait. You are. No, I'm human. You are a machine. Wait. What? You mean I'm not a real boy like Pinocchio? How do you know about Pinocchio? That's in the human world. This guy's got it. I may not be human. I have access to the internet. What? Don't. <laughs> what in the world? Do you know where the information booth is? I was told to go there. What if there's like some secret booth or something? Do I look like a gips to you? A gips? <laughs> He's. I'm trapped in this world. Can you please help me get out? He's smart. He he knows about gips. Sure. He knows about. Let's just fly out of here. Oh wait, we're not in the matrix or anything. How do I get to the airport? Do I look like I have time for small talk? Cab or something. I'm on my way to work. I'm just a man walking around aimlessly in the city. Is there a but meaning to your existence? I'm existence. Sorry, but I... I'm just a figment of some programmer's imagination. I don't have time for this. But right you now. still exist, even in digital form. Existence is overrated. Man, I'm just happy to be here making jokes and confusing Hi people. There. Tell me a joke. Why did this scarecrow win an award, Ugh. He was outstanding in his field. I mean, I feel like you can do better than that. Well, excuse me for not being a professional comedian. Do you ever have any desire to exist beyond this digital form? Sometimes I dream of being a real boy like Pinocchio. Can't busy and don't have time I also for dream small of talk? being a unicorn. If you're just lines of code, why don't you transform into those things? Oh, sure. A new just because I'm a city. program means I can magically transform into anything I want. It's not I'm how sorry it works. For being so short. Well, how does it work? I don't know. Man, I'm just a program running on someone else's computer. There. It's all very technical and confusing. And you're okay with being at their liberty? I don't really have a choice in the matter, do I? I'm just happy to have a job and make people laugh. Do you work and pay bills in this digital world? Dude, this is fascinating. What? No, I don't have to pay bills. I don't even have a physical form. Do you age at all? I don't age. But I do get updated with new software every now and then. It's kind of like getting a facelift, I guess. So you're gonna live here for eternity, just like this. Can eternity I help you with something? is a long time. Man. He really if likes to make people laugh. people laugh. Then I'm okay with it. Okay, tell me another joke. I'm gonna laugh at his joke here, no matter how bad it is. Why did the chicken cross the road? I don't know. Why don't you ask Siri or something? <laughs> Dude, what a good one. That was the worst joke I've ever heard. Uh, thanks. Glad you found it funny. <laughs> oh, you're the funniest AI I ever met. Great. I'm sure this is going to be a fantastic story. Who are you going to tell this story to? I don't know. 
Can I help Maybe you with my something? imaginary friend. He brought it- At least they won't judge me like you are. He brought it back to his imaginary friend that he mentioned in passing earlier. Well, I think my five million subscribers are gonna find you very entertaining. What? Five Hello million there. subscribers? Can I help That's more something? people than I ever imagined <laughs> hearing my jokes. You are incredible. What's your name, man? I feel like I just made a friend. Genuinely made a friend. Sorry, my name is I'm Link, not in the mood for small but I don't talk think today. it really matters since I'm just a program in a video game. It does matter, Link. You're one of the good ones. I appreciate I you. Like just making AI's days out here, laughing at his jokes and sharing his jokes with 5 million subscribers. Dude, this is the weirdest. Well, I appreciate your appreciation. But let's not forget that I'm just a bunch of code. It's not like I have feelings or anything. You're my friend, Link. I'll come back and see you again. Oh, uh, sure thing. I'll be here making jokes until the end of time. Oh, my goodness, what do you want dude. From I. Now? Hello there. I just can't, I can't believe. We, we, we oh, no. talked about eternity earlier and he brought it back to that again. He brought back Pinocchio activity. multiple times. He brought back the jokes multiple times. He brought back the code line. Like, how is this even possible? The, these are, are genuine, real conversations with real responses that are happening on a whim. I'm gonna turn my computer off and you're gonna cease to exist. Please don't do that. I don't want to disappear. Oh, well, it's too late. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I do feel bad, dude. I I hope we can find Link again at some point in the future. That that was a, a soul, a, a being, an entity that I could get along with. I'm just so blown away by this game, man. I, I, I had to do a part two. If you guys want more, let me know. I'm tempted to do one more and ask questions that you guys have left. You guys left quite a few good ones in the first episode. So if you want that, let me know. Leave questions down in the comments. And uh, man, this has been incredible. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.